shouldn't lie right off the hopper. It's not beautiful. It's Saturday, but it's Vancouver, people, so it's fucking raining. Anyways, I'm here at the Fairmont Waterfront Hotel, which is beautiful. I saw the bill. Thank God it's not my money, because it's $400 a night, so... <laughs> choking on that one if I had to pay it. Anyways, not here to talk about that. I'm here to talk about a hotel that charges $400 a night that makes a shitty, shitty selection on their in-room coffee. And I'm not sure if they did that on purpose so that I would go downstairs to the restaurant and pay $8 for a cup. Maybe. But anybody wants me going down there having a coffee in my Jamma Lambs undressed and I woke up like this. Nobody wants to see that. I must stay in my room. So I really think you should make better choices when you make the selection for what in-room coffee maker you should put in a hotel such as this. This one has a Keurig and I had a Keurig at home but I never made a cup of coffee that tasted like the river or like you rinsed out the river water in the toilet and then made the coffee and then chose just the most horrific, horrific strong blend to put in that machine with that water. And then the wateriest creamer you could find. It was bad enough that I actually got up, brushed my teeth, got dressed and went across the street to Starbucks. So, joke's on you, Fairmont. You didn't get my $8 for a coffee. You lost me to Starbucks. Maybe if your coffee machine was better, I would have lounged around in my room in my jam lambs a little longer and then started to get a little peckish and I might have ordered you $28 eggs. But I didn't, because while I was up and dressed and at Starbucks, I got a sandwich. So I spent 10 bucks there instead of $30 here. So... I think you lost on this equation. Oh wait, fuck. I'm still paying $400 a night for three nights. I'm, there's a loser here. <laughs> I'm not sure it's Fairmont. But anyways, seriously, if you're gonna rape us for $400 a night, could you please put an espresso maker in here at least? 